Hey YouTube, it's Mike again with another Superstar Collection review. This time we're going to be reviewing the Zack Ryder one. I watched this after uh, the Dana Bryan one. Because I really didn't know which one I should or wanted to watch, so I did Eeny, Meeny, Miny, Mo between all of them, and it landed on Zack Ryder. So let's get to a review. Since the debut of Z True Long Island Story in early 2011, bros all over the world have been cheering woo 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 for Zack Ryder. The sunglasses, clad, spiked hair, superstar contemplated himself to the top ranks, using the internet and social media to become WWE's first ever internet champ. In the special collection, first ever focus on Zack Ryder's features six of his greatest matches, most of which have never been released on DVD. One of the infamous on I when I see you you know it best of whatever. Um overall, this wasn't too bad. To be honest, I probably would have put different matches on here, like um I would have put the Zack Ryder and Kurt Hawkins becoming WWE tag team champions. I would put that on there. I would have put him against Tommy Dreamer when he beat Tommy Dreamer on ECW and ended Tommy Dreamer's WWE career. Um, yeah, I would have kept this match right here. That was a highlight match of his career. And that's all I could think of for now. For Zack Ryder's best matches. Um, but anyways... Zack Ryder vs. Christian. This was a damn good match. Um, probably one of the... Behind the Zack Ryder and Dolph Ziggler match, this was the bet, one of the best matches on DVD. It was just awesome. Next, Zack Ryder with Hugh Jackman vs. Dolph Ziggler with Vicky Guerrero. Kind of stupid, to be honest. I mean, if it was longer, um, then it would have been better, but I mean, it was just stupid. Like, Vicky gets thrown out, then Hugh Jackman breaks in where his draw. I mean, it was just dumb. Um, Zack Ryder and John Cena versus The Miz and R-Truth. This is actually a pretty decent matchup here. I felt like they dragged it on a little bit, but for what it was, it, it wasn't bad. And this was building up to Survivor Series and everything. And it was in England, so it was a very interesting crowd. Uh, Social Experiment, John Cena vs. Zack Ryder. Like, I didn't actually watch this on TV last time I recall, around the time. It was just like a, a regular match between Cena and Ryder. It was decent. Actually, it was good. Um... I think it was actually like five ten minutes. It, it was, it, it was a nice, you know, decent match. Lord knows why they called it a social experiment, but I mean, still it was good on the it, it was good on the West. Next up, Zack Ryder and Randy Orton against Dolph Ziggler and Wade Barrett. This was a good match too. I didn't think this would be that great, but it was pretty good. Um, Ryder and Ziggler winning. Now, damn me with the botch. Ryder and Orton winning. Um. No, the ending, Orton with the RKO to Ziggler. And when he pins Ziggler, he's staring directly at Wade Barrett. That was just a sick, sick moment there. Just awesome match overall. And Zack Ryder versus Dolph Ziggler for the U.S. title at TLC. Um, damn good match. Fast paced. And they both have a chemistry in the ring for each other. Zack's dad and the Big O were sitting front row. It was just a cool match and a cool moment for Ziggler winning the U.S. title. The crowd was definitely behind him. Everybody was cheering, let's go Ryder, woo woo woo. It was just fantastic on their part. So yeah guys, that's the review for the Zack Ryder DVD.